Brain health is a concern for everyone. Hopes of having a strong memory, being quick on your feet, and able to live every day's life on your own terms is the goal. One local organization is hoping to help those in the community with just that. Jess Lipson was at an event today, and this is all about improving brain cognitive ability. Tom, Mimi, that just touches the surface of what's being covered at the WITS Fitness Brain Exercise class. It also works on socialization as well as handling emotions in stressful situations. I'm all for brain health, you know, just doing whatever I can do to keep active and strong. Margot Ackling knows it's important to keep her brain healthy. That's why she and others checked out the WITS Fitness Brain Exercise class. It's an interactive session with activities, games, puzzles, all to improve and keep up with brain health. We'll have uh, some sort of problem that it doesn't really figure out the way that you expect it to. So you have to look at it upside down or you have to look at it by adding things together or skipping numbers or just doing like a rebus sort of kind of thing. Some exercises I thought, oh geez, I don't know if I can do these or not. But then as I went through them, you know, I could answer some of the questions and then I would think a little bit longer and then I could answer a few more. The event is hosted by the University of Illinois Extension. They hope to create opportunity for those in the community, young or old, to enhance cognitive brain function, memory, and more. The first part is uh, work on intellectual challenge, which is a major brain health contributor, as well as promote social connection so that they can interact with others, uh, participants in the program, get to know one another, uh, and just have a good time. Kathy Kane knows how important events like this are. Many in her life struggle with Alzheimer's disease and other brain health issues. So I just want to keep my brain as active as I can so that I don't have that issue. <laughs> I really have that because that scares me, you know, to all of a sudden not know what, you know, what time of day it is, you know, not being in control. One focus today was handling stress. April is National Stress Awareness Month. Experts say simply being active or keeping your brain active with games and activities instead of watching a screen can go a long way. With this weather, I think we should all go for a little walk. Mimi, Tom, I hope you guys got your steps in. That's a great idea. Thanks, Jess.